What's up guys, for today's video, I'm showing you a quick one on how to install a gas tank tie down strap. Uh, the product I'm gonna be using is from Boat Buckle. Should be a pretty simple installation. It comes with nice stainless steel hardware. Basically, you're gonna be attaching a couple mounting points on your boat and then threading through the strap and then strapping down your gas tank. So first thing you wanna figure out is where your strap is gonna run on the gas tank. On this gas tank here, it's gonna run right along the front here between the fill port and the fuel connector. That way it doesn't have any room to slip off. For example, if I did it across the top here, it could always slip down and then it wouldn't be tight anymore. After you figure out where you're gonna mount it on your gas tank, figure out where you wanna mount your gas tank. For me, the goal with this boat is to keep the weight as centered as possible, to keep the boat as stable as possible. So rather than having the gas tank slid to the side, I'm actually gonna have it slid over here. After that, I'm gonna go ahead and just roughly position the gas tank strap, and then we can check out the mounts. In the box, comes with our tie down, and then the mounts and hardware. These are the two mounts that need to get attached to your boat, and then it comes with some screws to make that happen. All right, so now that we know where the gas tank is gonna be positioned, let's go ahead and get the gas tank out and take a look at where we can put these mounts. Before I take the gas tank out to mark off where I want the strap, I'm just gonna put this piece of masking tape just so we don't lose our position. Okay, so it looks like I should be able to mount probably on, I'm gonna probably have to do the inside to have access with the screw gun. And then one mount on the inside opposite. And then that way, when the uh, strap threads through, it'll wrap around the gas tank, tighten it down, pull it straight down in place. Actually, it looks like rivets will work here. So I'm gonna go ahead and use rivets instead. So I'm gonna grab my uh, 3 16th bit. And the first one needs to be rough positioned. And then the second one needs to be lined up with the first one. Okay, that is solid. I'm just gonna go ahead and thread the uh, strap through to make sure we're still lined up. Oh yeah, it's pretty perfect. Now to hold this in place, I'm just gonna clamp it so I can drill it. Make sure everything's lined up correctly. Okay, so once you have your mounts in place, you're gonna go ahead and thread the strap through both of the mounting points. So we're gonna come down the one side and then up the other. Now we can put our gas tank back in place. And if we did our setup Correct in the beginning, it should lay right over your mounting point, which is perfect. So with your ratchet completely open and folded down, you wanna go ahead and hook it onto the back hook. Then with your free strap, you're gonna come down on the bottom portion, pull your strap through, tighten it, and then you're gonna come out through the top portion in this position. Okay. So now when you have that threaded through and you're hooked onto your loop, you can go ahead and tighten it up. And then with your strap in place, you can go ahead and cinch the buckle. You might need to do a little bit of uh, slack for it to really clamp it closed to close it. And you're all set. Now to get this open, it's super easy. You just grab by this strap here, pull up, that releases the whole thing. And then again, hook it on, pull it gently tight. Now our gas tank is strapped down to the boat. Not a very complicated install, but unless you've done it or seen it yourself, it can be a little bit tricky. I hope you guys found this helpful. If so, don't forget to hit that like button. If you wanna see more content like this and check out what I'm doing to this boat build here, don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching.